Hello everyone, in this lecture, we are going to explain the different uses of, have been, has been, and, had been. But if you are new to my channel then subscribe the channel and like the video. Well, let's move and learn it. The first use of, has been, is that it is used to indicate an action that started in the past and continues up to the present. Simply, it means that it is used construct a present perfect continuous tense but you need to remember that, has been, is used with these subjects, he, she, singular noun and, it. Just look at these examples. He has been teaching since 2005. Look at this example. This is the present perfect continuous sentence and here, has been, is used with a subject, he. Basically, it means that, he started teaching in 2005 and still the act of teaching is continue. She has been reading for two hours. Look at this examples, the phrase, has been, is used with a subject, she. And it is also a present perfect continuous tense. The next example is. Smith has been sleeping for one hour. Look at this example, the phrase, has been, is used to form a present perfect continuous. It means that Smith started his sleeping one hour ago and still continue. So you can say that this is a present perfect continuous tense. The phrase, has been, is also used in passive voice of present perfect tense. But you should keep in mind that it is used with these subjects, he, she, singular noun and, it. As you know passive voice that when an action is happened to a subject. Just look at these examples. He has been mistreated in the party. Just look at this sentence, here the phrase, has been, is used with a past participle verb and the subject is, he. And it is a passive voice sentence of the present perfect tense. You can see that here the subject did not mistreat someone but instead he was mistreated. The next example is. She has been given a book. Observe this one, again, the phrase, has been, is used with a subject, she, and it is a passive voice sentence. Because she did not give a book to someone but instead someone gave her a book. So the subject is acted upon. The next example is. Simon has been awarded with a trophy. Again the subject is, singular noun, so the phrase, has been, is used to form a passive voice sentence of the present perfect tense. So you can say that it can also be used as a passive construction of present perfect tense. The next usage is. Has been, is also used to talk about an action that happened in the past and has a result that is still felt in the present. What does it mean? Simply it means that it also used when we talk about an activity which has happened in the past but the result of the activity is still existed. Just look at these examples. She has been sick. Look at this example here the phrase, has been, is used to, to talk about an action that happened in the past and has a result that is still felt in the present. Basically, in this sentence, the action of being sick happened in the past but the result of being sick is still being felt in the present. So you can also use it to mention the state of anything which is still available to be shown. The next example is. The weather has been hot for the past few days. Again in this sentence the phrase, has been, is used. Actually, it means that the hot weather is still ongoing, and people are still feeling the effects of it. The patient has been in a coma for weeks. Observe this example the phrase, has been, is used with a subject, the patient. The coma is now over, and the patient is no longer unconscious. So it shows the state of the patient. You can simply say, this can also be used to show the state of people like this. Have been, is used in present perfect continuous tense to describe an action started in the past and still continue. Simply.
It means that this construction is also used in present perfect continuous tense but the thing you should keep in mind is that it is used only with these subjects, they, we, plural names and, I, look at these examples. We have been living here since 2013. Look at this example, the phrase, have been, is used with the subject, we, and it is present perfect continuous tense. But how? The answer is because it talks about an activity which started in the past and still continue. In this case we talk about living which started in 2013 and still continue. They have been playing football for two hours. Again observe this example, the phrase, have been, has come with a subject, they, and it is also present perfect continuous tense. Jack and Simon have been reading for three hours. Again we are having plural names, Jack and Simon, so with the phrase, have been, is used to form present perfect continuous tense. Simply, you can say that it can also be to make the structure of present perfect continuous tense. The next usage is. The phrase, have been, is also used to form passive voice sentence. Simply. It means that it also used in passive construction of present perfect tense. But this point you should keep in mind that it only appears with these subjects, they, we, you, plural names and, I. Just look at these examples. They have been gifted a watch. Pay attention to this example, the phrase, have been, is used with the subject, they, and it is a passive sentence because the subject did not perform the action but an action of gifting a watch was done to him. The next example is. We have been ignored in the meeting. Again the phrase, have been, is used with the subject, we, and it has formed the passive structure of the present perfect tense. I have been informed by him. Observe this sentence, the phrase, have been, is used with the subject, I, and it is a passive sentence. Simply, you can say that it can also be used to form passive sentence. Have been, is used as stative verb in the present perfect tense to show a state of being or the situation the subject of the sentence has been in for some time. It simply means that it can also be used to show state or situation of the subject but remember it is only used with these subjects, they, we, you, plural names and I. Just look at these examples. The guests have been hungry. Look this example the phrase, have been, is used with a subject, the guests, but here it shows the state of the guests and the guests are not doing something but only their state is described. Simply, you can say that it can be used to show a state of a subject. The next example is. They have been very positive about the jobs. Look again. Have been, is used as a linking verb to describe the state of the subject, they. The rumors have been false. Again the phrase, have been, is used to describe the state of the subject. Basically, in this sentence the verb, have been, is a linking verb. It is linking the subject, the rumors, to the predicate adjective, false. This means that the sentence is saying that the rumors are in a state of being false. Had been. It is used to form past perfect continuous tense which describes an action that started in the past and continued for some period of time. Simply, had been, is used to form past perfect continuous tense and it is used with all subjects whether it is, he, she, plural noun etc. Look at these examples. He had been living in this house since his childhood. Look at this example, the phrase, had been, is used to form past perfect progressive tense because it shows that the act of living was started in the past and continued for a certain period of time. The next example is. She had been watching a film for three hours. Again the phrase, had been, is used and it is also a past perfect continuous tense. John had been playing cricket for two hours. The phrase, 
had been, again is used to form past perfect continuous tense. The next usage is, had been, is also used to form passive voice of past perfect tense. It means that this phrase can also be used with all subjects to make passive voice. Just look at these examples. He had been arrested by a police. Here, had been, is used for making a passive sentence of past perfect tense. Here it is a passive voice because he did not arrest the police but the police arrested him. The next example is. They had been stopped from swimming. Again it is used to make a structure of a passive voice sentence, because they did not do something but something had been happened to them. Alec had been beaten by his friend. This is also a passive voice sentence of past perfect tense and it is formed through, had been. Well guys, if you have enjoyed the lecture then please like the video and subscribe the channel. Thank you.